Hi, I'm Matthew Malcolm with California Dairy Magazine and here today at the Tevelde Dairy in Hanford, California. I got to speak with Nick Slobber, the alfalfa production manager for the dairy. Although many growers have been struggling to maintain alfalfa production this year in the current drought, Nico is actually experiencing higher production per acre and here he is to explain just exactly how he's doing that. Uh, we're basically a dairy operation and I take care of the farming to supply feed for the animals. And uh, basically what we've done on the background here, we've planted some alfalfa and we put some drip tape in the ground. Um, it's a new adventure for us. So what we did is we figured out how to approach this deal. Uh, we planted alfalfa here in November of 2012. And so this is the second year of production that we have. And production on the rest of the ranch has been about 10, 10 ton average for the past couple of years, except for this year. On the drought. This year we're looking at the production on this and we're hoping to get about 14 tons with a very decent uh, TDN average throughout the year. As a dairyman, this, this drip tape is, I think, the future for us just because we can produce a lot more acres per acre foot of uh, a lot more tons of um, alfalfa per acre foot of water. I don't think you save much water, but I think you get way more production. So that, that's basically the whole thing. So on less acreage that we can get more production for the future. The way we, we constructed this drip tape is we're going to, um, after five or six years, depending on the production, we're going to come in, we're going to strip till it, we're going to put corn in there and wheat, and then we'll do that for a couple of years, and then we might come back with alfalfa after a couple of years. So our goal on, on this site is to try and keep that drip tape for about 10, 15 years if possible. So the drip type life is going to depend on how well we treat the water, how clean we keep the tape, and how good our, our gopher control is. So gopher control or gophers is probably one of our biggest problems, I think. And then the, if we can get that under, under control and the way that the water surges, and getting a little bit better understanding of following ET values and the time that we cut and the time that we irrigate. Um, they sell the tape and they say you can keep irrigating while the alfalfa is down. We have not done that just out of fear that we might get some water come to the surface and we're going to do some of the alfalfa. Uh, generally speaking it's, it's been great. Uh, there's a lot of technology involved. I think we can do a lot better and I think down the line in the future we'll look at different ways to approach this. Uh, better fertigation uh, and everything just to do is just, just our goal is to get more production per acre farm. Stay current on the best dairy and feed production management strategies by reading California Dairy Magazine. I'm Matthew Malcolm, CaliforniaAgnet.com.